Hey everybody, hope you guys are having a good day. So we just finished uh, uh, Churro Sunday. I just heard the craziest thing I have ever heard any of my daughters say, especially, especially this specific child. As I've said before, Natalia does not mess around with food. Natalia finishes her food and uh, she doesn't like to share either. And she's all about gobbling her food and candy and sweets. She actually said, Dad, I think that was too much. And that was way too sweet. Never. I know, it's Halloween. She actually said that. I cannot believe it. So, Nari, what do you got to say about yourself? Okay, so well, now you want to record. Yeah, now that Julio's done with the camera. No, so we just finished some treats right now and we're trying to decide what to do because, yeah, don't want to go home right now. So we're on our way right now to see if the March Airfield um, Museum is open. Crossing fingers that they are. But yeah. When did we discuss this? I wanted you to go into the website and see if they're open. That's what I wanted you to do. Oh, okay. Well, Julio's throwing a fit, so I'll check really quick. Yeah, do that. Bye. We just called uh, Mar the March March Air Field Museum. Uh, we're gonna give it a try. We've never been there before, so um, just something to do to get out of the house. So we're just stopping by to grab some essentials um, before we make that drive over there. You girls ready? Yes. Yes, but I feel like I've been there for my one of my field trips. Oh, you know what? I think you have. So I well, think I know what it looks like. Well, it's new to the rest of us, so. Yeah, here we go. It's like 94 degrees and they did um, I called so she let us know that They have the shop closed and they have anything indoors closed The only thing that's open is for you to walk outside and you can do the trim. So that's what we're gonna and We're gonna do I'm not sure if I'm gonna want anything, but anyway, we'll see You guys ready? I'm pretty sure you do, Natty. Yes. All right, let's go. So cool. I've always passed by this uh, museum, but not once have I ever stopped by. Do you have a coin? You have a coin. Go ahead and do it really quick. Oh, this is so cool. So, unfortunately, this time, just whatever you want in there, baby. You just put what you want. So, unfortunately, the inside is closed due to social distancing, which is completely understandable. Um, however, we're able to walk outside. But this is so nice. I love it. Love it. Okay. What are you putting? Do you have any sort of fish? Cool. Leave it! Not today, Sarah. Really, Samara? <laughs> <laughs> Let her penny go! <laughs> She's <laughs> terrible, Samara. <laughs> There's other coins in there. Okay, oh, I'll take my umbrella. That is so cool. That's so cool. I like that. No, you cannot touch them.
When you came for your field trip, Arissa, did you walk around all on the inside over there? I remember that big one. Did you That's cool. I did see all the planes. Like, there was a whole bunch. And then we toured over there, like, where it has blocked off. Oh, you went all the way over there? Yeah, we, like, toured everywhere. It was cool, but we couldn't touch them. So, somebody's asking me if those are real missiles. I don't know, but that thing scares me. Tell the chick at the engine. Uh. <laughs> Look at it, that is so cute. It's a two person. Wow. Right on top of each other. I'm on the set of MASH. Don't you feel like you're on the set of MASH? Oh my God. <laughs> I hated that show. You hated that show? It was not funny at all. <laughs> Ooh, I want to see what that is over there. Helicopter? No, that over there. I was like, what the heck? <sighs> For a second when I first walked in, I was not expecting that. I was like, whoa, why do I feel like I'm on the middle of a war zone? <laughs> That's crazy. Girls, go clean up your room. You, go now, clean. hurry. Samara, it's mandatory. Go hurry, let's hurry. go. Hurry, Duck. The trash guy's coming. <laughs> this is so cool. Look at that plane. That one's huge. There's a fan? I know. That sounds crazy. You ready for your, you want to get on your car, Julio? Take your car home? Oh, really? Shoot. The vinyl seats? Hell no. Flat tire and all, it's yours. <laughs> <laughs> Loading little boy. The atomic bomb. Oh, wow. The atomic bomb that destroyed Hiroshima. Really? Wow. Wait, is Hiroshima a big town? Look at that. That's crazy. Down there, see? Oh, I see it. Yeah, but this one's huge. On top of the, and also on the back. Look at the cars. cars. I am. Look at this light. Imagine something like this Shh. lighting the night sky. I'm gonna say these use actual gas for the for lighting. Really? Yeah. And then uh, they're air cooled, so it's making it easier, uh, so you don't have to deal with uh, radiators or anything. Oh wow! See? Oh wow! This, this is the gas pump right here. So this will be the alternator because it's got that. That's just a whole new language to me, babe. I really don't know. It just all looks a big metal mess. But look at this right here. Gas log. Well, this is where they used to, where they used to hold the, um, the, oh my God, what do you call it? Ammo box. Oh. 
at least put their ammunition. That's crazy. They're restoring that. But we're not supposed to go in there. So what it, what plane is this again? I didn't catch you saying I that. I have no idea. But oh, but you said it's to ref refuel? Yeah. Oh, okay. It's a refueling plane. Crazy. What are you talking about? This I mean, plane carries the guests. That's what I meant. I mean, where do they... Where do they what? Yeah, we'll just leave that alone. Look at the stars. Oh, by the way, Chrissy. That yes. plane right there? That's the planes that they used to fly in, in the movie Top Gun, F-14s. Oh. Well, I never knew that. Yeah. But that's nice to know. Alright, so where are we headed to now, babe? There, if the girls quit complaining. <laughs> Are you girls up to going to the other side? Yes. Yeah. To the other side over there, because remember there was more planes over there where we parked. So yeah. imagine being sucked into that duct right there. It says the inlet inlet duct and a 25 foot adjacent area must be free of all loose objects prior to and during engine operation. Because, yeah, that, it's not like they could just shut it off, I mean. That would be so scary. Imagine being sucked into something like that. Huh? I saw the plates. Let me see. They're all the way in the back. Look at that. Imagine being sucked down there. Oh, there's an echo. That is scary. Let me see. Go ahead. That's scary. For reals, that is terrifying. And imagine the noise too. Oh, yeah. You probably ruined the whole engine too. The oh, engine. I'm sure. But the noise, man. I have become the umbrella lady. Ooh, look at this one. 